Welcome back to the CAA Minute, your daily headlines from around the CAA. Last night in men's hoops, it was the R.J. Hunter show as the Georgia State freshman finished with a career-high 27 points, including a three-pointer with one minute to play and a blocked shot with less than two seconds left in leading Georgia State to a 71-69 win at Towson. The CAA announced its weekly award winners for men's and women's hoops yesterday. Georgia State's Manny Atkins averaged 21 points and five rebounds last week for the Panthers. And Northeastern's Quincy Ford averaged 20.5 points and shot 63% from the floor to both earn Player of the Week honors. George Mason's Marco Giuanicic was the Rookie of the Week after posting a double-double in the Patriots' win over JMU last Tuesday. Delaware's Elena Deladon poured in 38 points in a win over Towson on Sunday, and Drexel's Taylor Wooten notched back-to-back 20-plus -back outings for the first time in her career last week, helping each to Player of the Week recognition. Old Dominion's Laquanda Younger drilled eight triples in road contests last week to pick up the Rookie of the Week award. National postseason honors continue to roll across CAA football as four league players were named to the 2012 College Sporting News Fabulous 50 All-America team on Monday. Old Dominion sophomore quarterback Taylor Heineke, the organization's Offensive Player of the Year, was joined on the list by James Madison's Earl Watford, New Hampshire's Matt Evans, and ODU long snapper Rick Lovato. Maine's Justin Perello received honorable mention honors. For the CAA Minute, I'm Bobby Broyles.